What's up everybody? I hope you're having an amazing week and amazing day and I just wanted to kind of open my heart um, this week, you know, I know that each and every one of us go through times where we question if our abilities that we have are good enough, that we, if we are well enough equipped to do the things that we feel like we're called to do or that we love to do and I just want to share with you even my situation of what I've been through this week where literally asking if I truly have the gift I mean I compare my start doing research and I start comparing myself to all these amazing people and I think dear Lord these people are, are such eloquent speakers they're so amazing who am I, I, I I'm, I'm not an eloquent speaker and uh, I forget about what I do have and I, I begin to focus on these things that I, I, I put in my mindset that this is what's where it's supposed to be when God has given me my own set of tools my own set of gifts that gonna speak to certain people and that's what I have to worry about that's what I have to work with and that is my gift it's my blessing and and I forget that sometimes so I know you're there with me I know that every single one of us go through this and um, you know it's not about the amount of gifts that you have it's 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 what you're given and it's what you do with that gift and I just want to challenge you guys to be thankful with me thankful for the gifts that you do have the things that you're gifted with because it only takes one thing you know it seems like the people who are the least gifted are the biggest game changers in the world and um, and I say least gifted uh, meaning that in their eyes or in the eyes of many other people that they are not the most gifted it's the people who show up. It's the people who can keep showing up day after day doing what they're supposed to be doing. And those are the people who become huge game changers in the world. And I am challenging my own self and I challenge you guys to walk with me in this to uh, really embrace who you are and the gifts that God has given you and blessed you with and go out there and be an amazing game changer. Don't worry about the things that you don't have. Don't worry about the things that you think that you're supposed to have in order to be the best. Just show up and keep doing the great things that you are blessed with and the great things that you have in your heart. Because to this week, man, you know, it, it hit me hard. I, I felt like there's been a whole day just hurting and, and having this pain in my heart and and feeling like i'm not good enough and and um you know some days we need to go through that in order to feel great again tomorrow so you know i'm not going to beat myself up for feeling that way but i'm not going to stay there man because i am going to be disciplined enough to change my mindset and i know what god has given me and i know what's in my heart and i know that i'm supposed to be a game changer in this world that i'm not supposed to be in this little corner somewhere in a closed up room i'm supposed to be doing great things in this world and i know that you are supposed to be doing great things you're born to be amazing you were born to be a light to this world you were born to do amazing and extraordinary things in your life so i just want to challenge each and every one of you to really step out step into your greatness step into those the gifts that you were given that you are specifically given Nobody else has your gifts. No one has a gift in a story that you have. Your gift in your story and your personal, what I call branding, is only unique to you. And only you can deliver what you were given. And you only you can deliver in a certain way that can reach certain people. Go be an amazing person. Go and do amazing things in your life. I love you guys. Have an awesome and blessed week. And um, I'll talk to you soon. All right. Love you. Bye.